Hi everyone, tonight we're looking at contour maps. What we've got here in front of us, we have a, a, a grid map. Now these are grid points with various levels on there. So just as an example, at A1 here we've got 110.2. There's how where we got our 110.2 from. Uh, B1 is 110.6, so if we go along the one line, here's our B1 intersection. 110.6. So this just gives us the height at these points. Okay. Now in between 110.2 and 110.6 we have uh, a 400 millimeter rise. Now when you're doing a map they might want you to plot the height of 110.4 and what we're going to look at is how we achieve that height how we achieve that, that point. We have a formula and it's the highest RL minus the contour level divided by the highest RL minus the lowest RL. Then we times it by the grid line length and that gives us the distance past the grid point or the distance from the highest grid point would be more accurate. This grid is 5 metres by 5 metres, so that means it's 0, 5, 10, and then it's 0, 5, 10. Okay, we're going to look at finding the RL of 110.4 in one spot, just between A2, which is here, 110.1, and B2, which is here, 110.5. This is just a random height that we've picked. Now to, to, to do the calculation on that, <coughs> the highest RL is 110.5, so here we have 110.5 here, minus the contour height that we're after, and that's 110.4, and then that's divided by the highest RL, which is 110.5, minus the lowest RL, which is 110.1, times the line length of 40 millimetres. This line from uh, A2 to B2 is 40 millimetres long. Okay, all these lines from point to point are 40 millimetres. Okay, so when we do that calculation, uh, 110.5 minus 110.4 is uh, 0 0.1 when we do that calculation there, 110.5 minus 110.1, it's 0 0.4. So we times it by the line length, that gives us uh, 10 millimetres, uh, and therefore the RL, 110.1, 110.4 is 10 millimetres from B2, because B2 is the highest RL. So what we have that little arrow there is 10 millimeters long and there's our grid point. Now looking at this uh, grid map we can draw a line we don't need uh, 110.1 we've already got 110.1 there and there at these two points at, at B3 which is there and A2 which is there. So we could uh, put in um, uh, 110.2 and we would do the calculations and these lines that are coming up when you do the calculations is where 110.2 would be then we would do 110.4 uh, and those marks that are coming up are 110.4 but you need to do individual calculations for each one of those grid points now that's 110.6 uh, there's our line, our contour line when we join the points at 110.1. There's our contour line when we join our heights at 110.2. There's our contour line when we join the points at 110.4. There's our line when we, there's our contour line at 110.5 when we join uh, the lines. And there's 110.6 when we join the lines. There's a lot of calculations, but that's how you do it. Uh, good luck.